Have you ever traveled abroad from the UK one day and thought, oh, I'll just catch up on that latest episode of Hollyoaks on 4D, and then boom, you're faced with this. Normally you would cry and hate on your life, but not anymore. Today I'll show you how to see that program no matter where in the world you are. So how are you going to do this? Well firstly you have to link to a VPN which is actually located in the UK and makes your browser think you're in the UK and as you can see from the software there's no additional software required and you do it from the normal place where you just set up Wi-Fi. So in this video I'm going to try to do it for the Mac and I'll make a separate one for Windows later and this is how you're going to do it. So first what you have to do is you have to open up system preferences and then you go to network and then you press the padlock if it's locked already and then you type in your password which I typed wrong and it shouldn't lock then you press the plus and you change it from Thunderbolt Bridge to VPN and change the VPN type to PPTP and as the name you want to add you want to add this that I'm copying and pasting, and I'll be putting in the description as the service name. And I guess it doesn't really matter what you call it, but this is what they told you. This is what they said to call it, so I'm just going with it. And I already made that, so I'll just press cancel for now. So I'll go down to where it is. So then after that, you should see this. If you press create, you'll see the same thing. And in the server address, you want to put this in and in the account name you want to put free and then afterwards go to authentication settings authentication settings and type 1234 as the password and then you press ok then after that you press apply which should be available to click view and you simply press connect and if you put to show VPN st status in the menu bar it will actually show up here so if I just come out of this, you can simply go to here and press connect. And then as you'll see, it'll say connecting for a bit. Then it'll say authenticate and then that's it, it's on. And it'll start counting. So then what you want to do is you want to go to Safari. And I'll just go back in history. So let me go to history. And after going through all the sound effects, go to Hollyoaks. And you'll see this page at first when you want to go to the website and you just press I agree and then it will redirect you to this page which is basically the people that are providing the VPN so then just go back to history and just go to it again and this time it should work you just have to agree that first time so then you go to history or you can or if you haven't got any history like I thought I did but I don't you could just type in there you go. And you can obviously use this for any program, and you can use it across different services too, like BBC iPlayer and if I can think of another one, ITV Player and stuff like that. And as you'll see now, that message should be gone, and you st should start seeing the advert, which basically means it's working. My internet's just been really, really fast, so that's why it's not working yet. So there you go. That's the advert. And we'll see your content will begin in 3, 2, and this basically means it's working anyway. And if you have ad block on, then it blocks it, just saying. So, yeah, that's it. So just the fact that the advert's working means it's working. That's been my video on how to access UK channels over the internet um, using a VPN from wherever you are in the world. And thanks for watching, and if you like this video, please press the link somewhere here, wait, that side, that says to subscribe, and press like down here, and also comment down there too, and thanks for watching, and now you can stop crying and go and watch your Hollyoaks in peace.